Hey guys, it's Zach from Engadget here to demo AirPlay Gaming over the iPad 2 and Apple TV. Now, I installed iOS 5 Beta on both the iPad and the Apple TV. And after you do that, double tap the home button here, flick on over to the left, click on this indicator, select the Apple TV, and if mirroring is on, your iPad display will then be mirrored onto your HD TV. Now as you can see as I flick back and forth, there's a little bit of a delay. Um, but it's not going to affect gameplay. So no iPad 2 uh, gaming demo is complete without Angry Birds, so let's start there. Alright. And as you can see, it's mirrored between the two displays, but audio is only coming from the Apple TV. Well, not bad for the first one. You can obviously tell that I've played this before. Alright, so let's go back to the home screen and then launch Real Racing 2 HD, which allows you to use the iPad 2 um, strictly as a controller while displaying gameplay in HD on the Apple TV. So it's a little uncomfortable to hold the iPad 2 out this far, but if you're playing normally and not recording a video, you'll have it a little bit closer to you. So let's select a quick race here. And I'll choose that track. And now as it's loading on the iPad 2, it's sending the display signal over Wi-Fi to the uh, Apple TV. Now, as you can see, you have some indicators on the TV. You have a speed indicator, time indicator, um, position, and a lap. And then all four of those are also duplicated on the iPad, your controller. And in addition, you have this uh, position map as well. And the game is very responsive. So while we saw a delay earlier, Pretty much as soon as I tilt the iPad, the, uh, the game responds. Alright. Let's crash over here. And there you have it. 